Hey guys, this week I'm back with another Circle of Colors. This is number four in my collection. It was the last one I was waiting. I was looking at this on the shelf and I didn't want to do it because I thought, oh, this is going to take forever because I remember the first one I did took four hours plus and I thought they're similar, you know, like the colors are arranged in, in circles compared to the other two that I did where the colors are section by section even the the fruits and vegetables like it's not as clear cut but it's still all the yellows together all the reds together and they were my two fastest so yeah i was looking at that one and i thought maybe it's even worse than the ice cream cake this one's called ice cream doesn't look like ice cream that much but then if you look into it yeah they have some fruits you got some blueberries here and there uh, you got these little raspberries in the middle. I don't even know what the white stuff is. Maybe some whipped cream. You got these little cookie sticks there. And then, yeah. So the thing with these is like when you get closer to the outside, it's longer and longer and you have more and more pieces of the same color. So I'll tell you right now the difference between those two is the final two layers that one guys it was so hard every pieces on the edge they were all blue and white it seems like you didn't get clues to help you it was just sort by shape and start moving so that's the difference and that's why this one was so much faster than my first one the outside edge the last layer you had lots of help some of the pieces had some green, some of them had some blueberry pieces, some of them had some really, really light blue, and then darker green. So I would say maybe half of the pieces on the last layer, I would pick up and I would immediately know where to go with it. Like almost precisely, this one goes there, this one goes there, this one goes there. And then the last half, they were all the same pretty much. So but then i had help because i had more info like more pieces to connect with so the last layer was much 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 faster on this one compared to the ice cream cake so yeah i was waiting i didn't want to do it i was just like it's gonna take so long it's gonna be hard it's gonna be exhausting but yeah it was not as bad as i thought so it was fun but it, it's always fun I would say so far of all my puzzles I did in 2024, I don't think I was ever frustrated with a puzzle except when I was missing a piece at the end. That's the only frustration. But I'm never frustrated when I do the puzzle. It's always fun. I love doing puzzles. So let me show you how I did that one. And at the end, I wanted to do a quick ranking of my least favorite to my most favorite of all four in my collection. So this is the puzzle. Once again, I want to do the speed puzzling. So I flip everything up, put the edges on the side. And I was puzzling before the six minutes mark. So I took all the white pieces. I was already putting them on the side at the end of my flipping part. But yeah, start with the white stuff. And then you have these raspberries to like really dark purple. They really stand out. So I think the, the middle part, like the start was faster than my usual circle of colors then i start putting on the side the brown pieces for the cookie sticks but i found out like they're not that easy to assemble so i took the red stuff and then i did the red circle around the raspberry so that was not too hard it was pretty good we're at 40 something minutes there and then we get to the orange so i took all the pieces with the little orange white with the little dots and that was pretty easy so you see huh it's like they they really stand out and then i start assembling a little bit of yellow a little bit of the cookie sticks and then yeah i think i stalled there a little bit i think that's the part where i really started to slow down got to the sticks i i really got stuck there but then the yellows and there's not a lot of difference between the the different yellows and also there you start getting more and more pieces there's like you see on the table right there's a lot of green and there's a lot of blue so there's a few different greens lighter green and darker green but yeah i went from the blue yellow parts like you see on bottom left bottom right you got some 
yellow and blue you know separated so i did that and then i try to get some clues because um yeah i was kind of stuck and you see the time go up and the puzzle doesn't seem to get a lot of progression so on the top there there's a really different green it's a it's a dark green um what i did there are the kiwis though you can see already huh i separated these these kiwi pieces and that really helped me but then yeah the other thing is on the blues and the greens you have some little cookie like chocolate chips i think so that's what i did next you know the green with the chocolate chips and on the bottom left the light blue with the chips so yeah i think i tried to connect these these little brown parts and after that it was about filling once i did most of the the, the I, I guess it's chocolate chips but then it's filling so filling the green filling the white blue like there's a light light blue on top with some really white parts i i, I say clouds but it's not clouds so i did that and i did the the dark blue the blueberries and like they do like little flowers on the blueberries you know they have these little orange middle so yeah after that look at that that's the final circle and it went super fast because you have a lot of help so yeah that's it two hours and 55 minutes for that one so i do take notes every puzzle i did in 2024 i write down the puzzle the number of pieces and how much time i spent on it even if it's not speed puzzling like my 1000 pieces i like to keep track just for fun even if i don't try to go fast i just want to remember how much time i spent so that was my first circle of colors i did the first one is rainbow cake and it took me four hours 17 minutes that one was really long one it was my first one and two it's a really really hard image my second one under three hours flowers two hours 46 minutes so one because it's easier and two i had a little bit more experience but then i did the fruits and vegetables and that one was my fastest ever because also again it's color by color in sections but also i had more experience and i did a lot more puzzles in between that one two hours and 22 minutes and then i went back to the one i didn't want to do i kept it for last two hours 55 which is just a little bit longer than my flowers if you think about it yeah it's hard but not as hard as the first one now it's time to do a quick ranking guys and i'll do that later when i have more because i have more on the way what was my favorite circle of colors so far and what was my least favorite so let's start with my least favorite okay and it's not just on how hard or long it took but also how i like the image so these were the longest two but even if this one was longer i think this one was my least favorite of all four because the artwork i don't think it's that great but yeah it was easier because you had more help and don't get me wrong I, I love all of them all the circle of colors are beautiful puzzles but if i could just choose one it wouldn't be that one and i don't think i recommend that one if it's your first one or, or that one either like these two are super hard but i love this one much better i think the image is beautiful the colors are lighter like it's cake frosting or something it's a beautiful beautiful image i love that one but it was hard so maybe these two are my least favorite but this one like the flowers would be my it would be a close call like it, it's a it's a cool one i remember that one was a lot of fun it was a bit long but it was fun it's not the most beautiful but if i would recommend someone one of these two I'd say go with the flowers just because it's it's just a lot of fun to do. It's fun. You can sort it by colors and you can do section by section. And there's no crazy edge on the last layer. So yeah, my second favorite, I guess. And my most favorite so far, fruits and vegetables. For multiple reasons. One, because it was faster. It was maybe a bit easier. So it's more fun when you're not stuck. Also, it's fun to just... Get a puzzle on an afternoon like a rainy day and just do that in a couple hours and you're done 
but also i love it i love that image the design of the puzzle the fruits the vegetables it, the colors are bright also it's my kind of illustration i like so definitely a cool one they're all good by the way all right once again i love the circle of colors and i have i think i have four more on the way guys it's gonna be my next video i have a puzzle haul let me show you the boxes yes guys not one but two boxes in the mail and one's pretty big i think the big box is like four circle of colors and the top box is three uh canadian national championship speed puzzling ravensburger puzzles so yeah it's gonna be interesting make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn on your notifications my next video is gonna be just the time lapse with music from the last circle of colors but next week uh it's gonna be a puzzle haul i'm gonna unbox these and i'm gonna show you what i got what's next i still have some 1000 pieces to finish right like i try different brand reviews so after the unboxing probably a brand review but then we're back with speed puzzling and circle of colors so i'm excited to show you guys make sure you don't miss thank you so much for watching leave me a comment below do you agree with my ranking of my favorite to least favorite on my four circle of colors i see a lot of comments and you guys seem to be collecting these I see some of you guys have like 16, 17, 18, or you're trying to get the whole set. So how are you doing on the collection? Because I think after this, I'll be at eight out of 18. I don't know if I'll get them all in the future, but I'm trying to pick my favorite ones here and there. Yeah, excited to show you what's next. Don't miss the next video. See you guys in the next one.